What's up guys, got some news about a possible shock drop happening tomorrow, which is Thursday, September 14th. It's been rumored for quite some time, but it looks like we're probably going to be seeing the Air Jordan 8 playoffs officially shock drop on the Nike sneakers app. And the time is a little bit sketchy, like we're here in 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, we're also here in 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But as you know, over the past, I don't know, maybe like three or four shock drops that we've seen over the past couple of months, there has been that like 15 minute warning that goes out on the Nike sneakers app where they send out the notifications and then, you know, they do upload the image for the shock drop 15 minutes before it goes live. Um, basically, what you're going to want to do if you're interested in picking a sneaker up is just be prepared to go um, anytime after, I guess, 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Just monitor the situation, have your notification bells turned on. Just, just be ready just in case you know they switch the time up because you know nike they could do all types of crazy stuff like cancel it or switch the time up or do whatever that they want because it is their app uh but it's a good thing that the air jordan 8 i think is going to shock drop because it's a sneaker that not everybody like really likes the jordan 8 does not get a lot of love it's not one of those sneakers that people absolutely have to have i'll be honest with you though the jordan 8 playoffs is a must call for your boy it's a sneaker that was one of the like first Air Jordans that I ever got. I remember when my grandfather took me to the store and bought me the Jordan 8, not only the playoffs, but also the Aquas. So I had, you know, two Jordan 8s and um, it's just one of those sneakers for me, you know, it just brings back memories. It's like a nostalgia thing for me. I'm not the biggest fan of the 8, you know what I mean? I don't have very many of them or anything like that, but the Jordan 8 playoff is a full go for me. Um, I kind of feel like if they didn't shock drop the sneaker, um, I don't know how many pairs they're going to have overall as far as like the shock drop and then the actual release that's going to be happening later this month. You know, if the sneaker would actually sell out because guys like the Jordan 8 is just not that popular. It's one of those sneakers that you either love it or you hate it. But if you're going to pick up a Jordan 8, the Jordan 8 playoff is probably the way to go. Um, that's the one, you know, it's an OG colorway. You know, I Michael Jordan wore it. It's just one of those sneakers that I think that everybody should have in their collection if they do like the Jordan 8 but like it's not a must cop for a lot of people I feel like once the sneaker does actually like officially release a lot of people will probably end up passing on the sneaker but right now the resale prices for these are high you know like 400 bucks and obviously once they shock drop prices are gonna come down I don't really see the sneaker being worth like a ton of money or anything like that so even if you take an L on the shock drop for whatever reason you know and you just have to have that sneaker just wait it out because the prices will come down there's also going to be the actual release date and this sneaker will not be reselling for three or four hundred dollars in my personal opinion this is probably you know like a retail like going for retail maybe slightly over retail kind of a sneaker um it's definitely going to be obtainable whether you hit on the shock drop or not so you know just keep that in mind guys like Jordan 8 just really isn't that like hyped whatsoever but you know if you like OG colorways maybe you're missing the Air Jordan 8 playoff in your collection you know this is a nice time to try to pick it up so once again it's supposed to be shock dropping tomorrow on the Nike sneakers app Thursday September 14th I'm here in 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time I'm also here in 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time so just you know just be prepared be ready to go you know if I hear anything confirming it I will make a community post here on YouTube so make sure that you guys you know are subscribed make sure you guys have your notification bells turned on and before I let you guys go we're on that road to 15,000 subscribers and at 15,000, as long as we get there before the end of the year, which I know we're going to, we're almost at 11. Um, I'm going to be doing another giveaway winner's choice between the Air Jordan 1 Chicago Lost and Found, the Air Jordan 3 White Cement Sneaker of the Year, right? Or Travis Scott Black Phantom. Winner will be able to choose one of these in their personal size. So share the videos out, subscribe to the channel, let your friends know because as soon as we hit 15,000 subscribers, I will run this giveaway. Other than that, guys, if you're interested in picking up the Jordan 8 playoffs, it will be shock dropping more than likely tomorrow. So good luck on that. I'll catch you guys in the next video really, really soon. I'm out. Peace. For more sneaker content, make sure you hit that subscribe button and you hit that notification bell so you never miss a video.